Hello everyone, thank you for watching this video where I will answer another question that is Is the singleton object in Spring Framework thread safe? The answer is no, it isn't thread safe and that's why a lot of developers actually prefer to use the auto wiring on the constructor rather than auto wiring on the field because that way they can define their singleton objects as immutable and that will start would start with actually making the attributes final and of course if i would do so for example in my dependency injection situation here i wouldn't be able to simply auto wire on field because this now from the syntax uh, point of view requires a value that the, the constant doesn't have a value yet so it won't compile but if i change the auto wiring and put it on the constructor level like this just define a constructor and then have the parameter here in which spring will inject my value the auto wiring will now be done in the parameter of the constructor then i am able to assign myself the value here and then i'm also able to leave this final which makes my object immutable and the reason for why i want my attributes to be immutable is to make sure that nobody changes them because a singleton is not synchronized by spring in any means it is not even recommended never do so never change attributes on a singleton object theoretically this is possible if you for some reason would change to do so will choose to do so make sure that you yourself do the synchronization by any means you can use the synchronized keyword in java you can use uh, lock objects like semaphore read write locks cyclic barriers and so on you can use uh, any kind of third party library for that it's your choice but you should do that is not spring doing that for you however going back this is not recommended if you ever have a situations in which you have to change the value of an attribute of an object that is also managed by spring at the same time take into consideration choosing a prototype it might be the solution for you but never from my point of view you should never get into a situation in which on a singleton object you change values on fields this is not thread safe and spring will not help you with that you have you have to help yourself thank you very much for watching the video thank you very much for the question again and stay tuned for new questions